Hi. Today we will see how to find the swing high lows in the TradingView Pine script. There is no definite way to find the perfect swing highs and lows, but there are several logics that work decently. Let's see one of such logic. First, we will see the logic to finding the swing high. Let's group the bar chart into groups of 3 3 bars. The last bar's high should be lower than its previous bar's high. The second last bar's high should be higher than its previous bar's high. This is where you may find a swing high. Now, let's see the logic to find the swing low. The last bar's low should be higher than its previous bar's low. The second last bar's low should be lower than its previous bar's low. This is where you may find a swing low. So this second bar is where you may find your swing high or low. I know this is not the absolute perfect logic, but it works okay for me. To make this logic better, you may use a group of 5 bars or 7 bars instead of 3 bars. The number of bars in a group should always be the odd number. And the middle bar must be where you find your swing high or low. Enough with the talks, let's see the code now. This is the indicator function with the name. Swing high low. Here we find the swing high. If the current bar's high is lesser than its previous bar's high, and if the previous bar's high is higher than its previous bar's high, then the middle bar's high is our swing high. Similarly, here we find the swing low. If the current bar's low is higher than its previous bar's low, and if the previous bar's low is lower than its previous bar's low, then the middle bar's low is our swing low. Finally, we plot an indication triangle to denote these swing high lows. Since we get the confirmation on the third or the last bar, we offset this triangle indication by minus 1. Let's add this indicator to the chart. As you can see, this is a swing high. And this is a swing low. This logic captures the actual swing high lows perfectly, but along with them, it captures some intermediate false signals also. But as I said earlier, there is no perfect logic to find the swing high low that is this much simpler. So that's it. That's how you can find the swing high low in the TradingView Pine script. Thank you.